everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to use our Quickles mixture to make pickled eggs. First things first, you're going to get your pot of water on and you're going to get that up to a boil. Once your water has come up to a nice rolling boil, you're going to go ahead and put those eggs in. Once you've got your eggs all in there, you're going to go ahead and set the timer for 12 minutes and let them cook until fully cooked. Okay, so I've got all my eggs in the cold water bath now. I have added some ice to help cool them down a bit faster and I'm just going to let them sit here until I can touch the shells without feeling the hotness. And then we're going to go ahead and get those peeled. Okay, so I've got all my eggs peeled. They peeled up super quick. So I have 10 in this one liter jar. Um, you can make a smaller batch if you would like or you can double the recipe if you want to do a couple jars at a time. So we're going to get started with the actual quickle mixture. Okay, so I'm going to use my 4-in-1 uh, Epicure spoon here, and I'm going to get 1 tablespoon of the Quickles mixture. Just put that right in there. I'm going to get 2 tablespoons of sugar. And then a teaspoon on the other side of the coarse, sea, or the coarse salt that is meant for pickling. Put that in there. And we're going to go ahead and put in our cup and a quarter of water our three quarters cup of the vinegar and we're going to get that up to a boil. Once it's at a boil we're going to turn it down to simmer for five minutes, pour over our eggs and then we're going to just let the eggs cool and then they're ready to serve. It's come up to a nice hard boil so now we're just going to turn it down to low and let it simmer for that five minutes. There you have it. In as little as a couple of minutes once this cools down I will have some pickled eggs. Um, I do suggest however to let the flavor enhance to leave it for about a day. Um, but it's still way shorter than normal uh, pickled eggs recipes that have to sit for about a week. So if you have any questions about the Quickles mixture, just send me a message or comment down below and I'd be happy to help you. Thank you and have a great day.